In this video, I will show you the meaning of slow living. I will talk about what slow living is all about. What are the things we can do to practice slow living? And challenges you may encounter with slow living. What does slow living mean? Is it a lifestyle or a way of life? And why should you consider adopting it? Slow living is defined as a deliberate choice to live deliberately. Slow living involves slowing down, simplifying our lives, and focusing on the things that matter most. Slow living is the new way of living for a busy generation. It's about slowing down, reconnecting with yourself and others around you, and finding happiness in the little moments that make up each day. It's about simplifying your life to focus on what matters most to you and create meaningful changes in your lives by changing how you do things. Slow living is not just about slowing down but also taking time to appreciate the good things in life. It's not just about how you live, but also how you consume things. In the next part, I will explain what slow living is all about and what you can do to practice slow living. Please consider supporting my channel by subscribing and liking this video. What is slow living all about? The concept of slow living has been around for a while now. Still, it is only recently that the term has garnered worldwide attention because of the increased popularity of minimalism. Slow living is not just about being busy, it's also about enjoying the present moment. So when we talk about slow living, we're talking about living deliberately. We're talking about being aware of what matters and making choices based on those values. In other words, it means having the courage to say no to activities that don't matter. It means taking control of your life to make decisions that will help you achieve your goals. Here are the seven things you can do to practice slow living. 1. Have fewer commitments. You may feel like you have many obligations. However, if you look at them objectively, you'll realize that most are not important. If you want to simplify your life, get rid of unnecessary responsibilities. This does not necessarily mean that you need to give up everything. Instead, you must choose which ones are essential to you. 2. Focus on the positive. When you focus on the negative aspects, it becomes overwhelming. Instead, try to see the good points. The problem may seem huge, but there are always ways to solve it. 3. Be grateful. Gratitude helps us appreciate the small things in life. By appreciating the little things, you're helping yourself. 4. Make a list. Write down everything that you have to do each day. Then prioritize these tasks. Don't take on anything that isn't necessary. 5. Do one thing at a time. Try to complete only one task per day. This will allow you to concentrate on that particular activity without getting distracted. 6. Take breaks. As much as possible, avoid multitasking. This is because it takes away from our concentration. 7. Get enough sleep. Sleep deprivation makes us tired and unfocused. Therefore, it affects our productivity and overall well-being. Challenges in slow living. Of course, slow living is not easy. Some people find it difficult to slow down. They want to rush through their days, spending hours doing meaningless activities. There are challenges involved in adopting this lifestyle. However, slow living requires discipline. It means putting aside our desires and focusing on what's important. To accomplish this, we must first understand ourselves better. We all have different priorities. For example, some people value family above all else. Others put careers before relationships. Still, others place health and fitness above all else. The key is finding out what matters to you. Once you know what matters, you can start prioritizing. Slow living also involves making changes. If you're used to working long hours, you'll probably be reluctant to change your habits. However, if you want to live a more meaningful life, you need to make sacrifices. You'll probably have to change your habits. That's why it's so important to be patient with yourself. It won't happen overnight. But by following all the steps in this video, you'll eventually reach your goal. If you'd like more information on slow living, please subscribe to my channel to be updated with my new videos. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.